All right, it's Jake Mace with Phoenix Longevity Arts. This video is gonna to touch on one of my favorite areas of Chinese Qigong, especially when I'm talking about strengthening my body. This set is very challenging for the legs, it's challenging for the breathing because you'll get very tired, and it's also challenging for the arms, but you have to have the ability to isometrically contract all your muscles at will. So if you're gonna to go to the gym and lift you know, uh, dumbbells or barbells, you, know, you don't need to to isometrically contract anything because your body's gonna have to lift that weight, it'll contract on its own. But let's pretend that you didn't have any weight and you were gonna, if you go back a little bit, and you were going to curl an invisible force up and then push a force down, you can get a lot of resistance training by doing that, by flexing all the muscles in the arms on the way up and then flexing the muscles on the way down and then up and then down, and then up. It's similar to like if you were a professional bodybuilder, when they go out and they perform in their shows, it's very exhausting for them to do their set because they have to contract those muscles for minutes. And it's tough to do, they get a good workout that way. So Qigong is kind of like that, especially this particular brand. It was said to have been created by a famous Chinese general known as Yue Fei, and his soldiers would do this brand of Qigong while riding horses. Okay, like going into battle or into war. Let's try to do a few moves right now. So this Yue Fei Qigong starts from a natural stance. We bow and we breathe in as we pull our hands to our waist. So really, if you're watching our videos for entertainment, that's fine, but if you really want to practice Qigong, this would be a great chance to stand up and try these movements with me. So pull your hands in like this, take your right leg and simulate the action of getting on a horse. Breathe in, step onto the saddle, and then your heels are going to be up with your ball of foot only touching the floor. The elbows are pulled back and you're using the muscles in your back like you're holding a Coke can between your shoulder blades. We're going to exhale and push our fists into the ground as hard as we can as we squat. We're going to exhale that light hiss because that's going to help to smooth out our breathing. So breathe in and lift the palms up now. Breathe out like you're crushing a brick between your palms. Using a lot of tension. Breathe in like you're gathering up some sand off the floor. Breathe out like you're smoothing that sand out. Breathe in, lift up with tiger claws like you're grabbing a t-shirt and then breathe out as you rip the shirt in half. Using all the muscles in your back. Breathe in and put the palms up like this and come up. Breathe out and hold up the roof. Your stance should be working at this point and up natural. This is part one in the UEFA series. We're gonna break it up to make it manageable chunks and that'll probably be about three parts. This is part one. So cue back in for our next videos for part two and part three. Practice this part about 10 times. Mentally get it down and then try to do it with as much tension and as deep breathing as you can do. Good luck.